at Cards.com, we did our Agile transformation about three years ago, and we were paper cards first, and then we did an evaluation of a number of different tools, and version one was the one that we decided to, to uh, use, and we've been using that for a little over two years. Uh, the version one was the closest to the way we were doing the paper cards, and it seemed to fit our process the best, um, without having to change our process to fit a tool. Um, so having a paper wall, it's great when you're looking at the paper wall, but after you take down the cards and you go on to your next story, the visibility to the history is, is almost lost, so you have to have some card catalog or way to keep that. Uh, version 1 gave us that ability to have all of that back history. At, at, at the beginning, that was the, one of the biggest pain points. You know, I, I mean, as a Scrum Master, I really like the new team room features. We've been using those since they, since they uh, launched, I believe, sometime last year. Uh, I see version one as, as a very as a very necessary um, piece of, of our job, but because we have to do some sort of things as far as tracking and being able to, to keep up, updates and in a bigger organization with, with lots of product teams, tracking all that on the paper wall just doesn't scale very well. It didn't scale very well for cars.com.